Hi, I'm Teacher Max. This is Form 4 at Maths Chapter 2, Quadratic Function. Today, we are going to learn how to solve quadratic equation. Now, let's cast our mind back to linear equation that we have learned much earlier. Now, if we have an equation like that, how are we going to solve this equation to find the value of x? For this one, we are going to add 7 to both sides. And we get x equal 36. This one, we are going to divide both sides by negative 3. And we get x equal 8 over 3. Even for this one, which is not a linear equation, we can take the square root of both sides. And we will get x equal plus or minus 6. Right. But then, how about this equation? Or this equation? How do we solve this equation? This equation that has the highest power of 2 are called quadratic equation. So how are we going to solve quadratic equation? To find the value of x that satisfy the quadratic equation. First, we are going to look at a quadratic equation that we can easily find the answer. For this one, first we are going to move this one to the left hand side. Right. After that, we are going to factorize this one. Square here, 8 here, and 6x here. And uh, 2 times 4, we get 8. x times 4 is 4x. x times 2 is 2x. Right, so this one can be factorized as. Look at this one. Either one of these expression is zero. The whole thing is zero. If this one is zero, then zero times this we get zero. Or if this one is zero, then this one times zero we get zero. So we have x plus 2 equals 0, x plus 4 equals 0, and we get x equal negative 2, x equal negative 4. So if we substitute this negative 2 into here, then this one becomes 0, 0 times this we get 0. If we substitute this negative 4 into here, then this whole thing becomes 0. And this times 0 equals 0. So for this one, this quadratic equation, there are two answers. Which is x equal negative 2 or x equal negative 4. 